On February 28, 1844, one of the worst disasters to ever strike the U.S. government took place aboard the USS Princeton on the Potomac River when many of the top members of John Tyler's government met aboard the ship to see a demonstration of its capabilities. The captain decided to fire his largest gun, a 12 inch, 27,000 pound behemoth that was known as Peacemaker when disaster struck. The gun had already been fired twice when the Secretary of the Navy urged every one of the 400 passengers up on deck to see the final shot. When it fired, the gun exploded, instantly killing the Secretary of the Navy, the Secretary of State, an enslaved man named Armistead, who was President Tyler's personal valet, a captain named Beverly Kennan, Tyler's future father-in-law, lawyer and politician David Gardner, and a Maryland attorney named Virgil Maxey.